Hey, this is Full Game Prometheus, uh, and if you guys are new to my channel, make sure to subscribe button and also that notification icon. Uh, this is going to be a little bit of different format than I normally show my tips videos. Uh, I want to show you gameplay uh, against an opponent I was running against. Uh, he actually had the Chargers, I had the Bears, and uh, this guy um, he was getting massive block sheds with uh, Joey Bosa and Ingram, um, and actually just catching off my offensive line. So as you can see right here, there's three plays in a row right now. Uh, I actually had to go pop the ball away. So um, basically he hit me with a screenplay. I was playing with a cover two shell. He gets really good blocking and a phenomenal spin move or jerk move right there. Uh, they go ahead and take the ball in the house going up seven to nothing. So um, uh, basically on offense, my offense is extremely flat. Another block, another sack right here by Joey Bosa. I can't get my plays to develop. Um, come back around. Uh, he basically takes away one of my routes, and I've actually missed throwing the ball. So I'm in a serious situation right now. I can't basically get anything off. My offense is just looking really flat against this Chargers team, and I had to. I have to make some kind of drastic changes. So I go ahead and decide I'm going to play around with my defense and see if I can change things up. So uh, right here is just a little punt play. And he gets it down. So I'm going to be talking about the uh, 52, uh, the 5-2 uh, uh, blitz uh, formation. Uh, it's a it's a formation where you got five down linemen, you got two linebackers, and then basically four defensive backs. And this is what I did. I switched into it. Uh, the meta right now um, online is the uh, fire zone two. It's a play, and there's a couple of ways you could set it up. You could shift your line off to the left or off to your right. Basically, what I did with this particular play is I actually spread my defensive line out, crash them out, spread my linebackers, make sure I uh, base the line so I can bring one of my linebackers in. I'm going to blitz one linebacker. So you're basically sending six right here, and it's a cover two shell. You can see right now defensive backs back up a little bit uh, just to kind of throw off his reads. And then you're going to hover over the guard to go and preoccupy a blocker right there. And you can see I pick up a, a, a sack. So... Fourth and twelve type of situation, same type of a situation. He actually spreads out his defense or offense. That's so actually a good idea. But he throws right to my user, and I pick him off. So in a situation right now where uh, he basically didn't have an answer for that blitz and I'm able to go in and attack him, I go and hit him with a nice little play underneath uh, to get the ball down to the 25-yard line. Come back around, and right here I try to hit the sideline. I'm actually the ball sails a little bit on me. And uh, right here, I'm trying to go ahead and hit, hit the ball right up the middle of the seam. I think I'm able to go and get the animation right there. So this guy came off the edge, and, and my uh, uh, player actually came up with it. And then I start whacking him with uh, a strong close type of situation in the middle in the end zone. Uh, hit him with a wham, a little crosser route with the trail play to be able to get it into the red zone. And right here is a play that I was working on in the red zone. It's something I haven't done in a while. It's been months since I used it. Uh, I try to go and hit the backside with the, with the quarterback, uh, with the uh, the uh, tight end, with the quarterback, but the ball sails, not, knocking him out. So this time I go and go to the backhand side, which is where Robbins is at. Defender doesn't play it. I'm able to get the animation to get, the, get a touchdown. So less than a minute left. I figured, what the hell, I might as well just go ahead and stay with uh, this blitz. And you can see I get two blitzers that come in and I actually sack him because he does not send, uh, he does not block six. So you know huddles again, he has no answer for it. Once again, send up the same blitz. Uh, I've got sp spies out there, but I, go, I get rid of the spies. Pressure comes in, uh, but he actually has to get rid of the ball of the flat, and my defensive back is out there to go and play that. He you know huddles again. And uh, this is where I got pretty lucky animation, uh, but it, it definitely frustrated him. He had no answer for it. He goes past defender, but my cloud flat, or my actually my, my deep flat out there is able to go and play that ball and sw smack it away. And I didn't want to keep sh uh, keep using this blitz too much against him, so I went and changed up my defense. Uh, so I went into the uh, into the 43 because it was a four uh, fourth and seven type situation. And I'm going to go back to my safety blitz three just to change things up. Um, <clears throat> just to go ahead and give him just a different type of a look. And uh, right here, because he's so used to pressure, he kind of he, he's he kind of gets rid of the ball quick, and I'm able to go and get a stop. And he actually quits out. He literally quits out. The game's tied 7-7. Seven, seven. Um, I'm you know getting the ball back. I'm just going to get about a field goal if I'm lucky, or maybe a touchdown. But he quits out. So. Uh, I would definitely go and check out that 52 um, uh, uh, nickel, the, the, the 52 uh, Tampa uh, Tampa defense. It's it's pretty effective, and it looks like you can definitely go and get you some stops. So once again, I'm a subscriber. Thank you for support, and until next time.